shit. You know the drill. Another episode of Hashtag Killing It. About to go down. Already on episode five. Can you believe that shit, Coco? It's like we just started and like all of a sudden we're on episode five. I guess that just shows you how hard we're fucking killing it, dude. Hell yeah. Anyways, we have a very special episode today, and it's not just because it's episode five. Straight up, we're introducing our brand new field correspondent, as well as a whole new segment called Field Report. So it is with great pleasure and ease that I bring to you my boy, John Hernandez. John, take it away. Thanks, Blake. I'm here at the scene of the sad ass patio at the bottom of your apartment building, and straight up, recently, I was able to sit down with your building manager and ask hella questions to find out why this patio is so sad. Go ahead and roll the footage. First and foremost, Chuck, I would like to thank you for joining me today on Hashtag Killing It with your boy Blake Banks. Yeah, man, I, I don't know what we're doing here. Well, I'll tell you what we're doing. Basically, this is probably the world's saddest patio. Go ahead and roll the clip. Yeah, it's just me and you here, man. Oh, sorry, the clip was rolling, so just let that happen, and then we'll talk about it. So what do you have to say about that? Yeah, we just looked at each other. There wasn't... There was no clip, man. We're not on a TV show. Well, basically, let me tell you, that clip is just more footage, more coverage of this very sad-ass patio. Right, I thought there was like a problem out here. Like, it was like something that needed to be fixed right now, so I didn't know. There is a problem out here, Chuck. This is a sad-ass patio. For instance, look at this chair. It's got mad bird shit on it, dude. Look at those leaves in the corner, dude. Who's blowing the leaves, man? They're just sitting there. All right, well, I could, I could probably take a hose to that chair, and then uh, that's only a couple of leaves, so I ain't sweating that. But it doesn't stop there, Chuck. Where does it stop? Where's the barbecue grill? Where's the slip and slide? Where's the better faucet? I mean, Chuck, look at this faucet. Yeah, man, it works. I don't know what's said about something that works. No one should have to be subject to drink that gross-ass water, dude. It's not for drinking. I don't even know why that's there, really, to be honest with you. What are you doing? You're the one who agreed to this interview, and it seems as though these hardball questions are not ready for you, or you're not ready for the hardball questions. You seem so ambitious. Why don't you be the building manager? I don't live here, Chuck. Yeah, you do, Blake. I take your check every month. I am not Blake. I am John Hernandez. You're 3B. You're like, I'm 3B. I don't live here. You say that every time, yo, 3B. Sorry, I'm John Hernandez, field correspondent for Hashtag Killing It with your boy Blake Bex. Ah, yeah, this is ridiculous, God damn it! What am I doing here? Just that little bitch. Where are you hiding, Chuck? Where are you hiding? Guess that's one way to end an interview. Wow, that certainly was one way to end an interview. I'm John Hernandez, reporting live here at the Sad Ass Patio. Back to you, Blake. Wow, John. That sure was one way to end an interview. I can't believe all that shit's gone down right downstairs, Coco. <laughs> Definitely some kind of a conspiracy happening, that's for sure. Pretty much that's all the time we got for you today. I've been Black Vapes, your host, with Coco the Coco host. And don't forget, hashtag killing it is brought to you by Blake Vapes 2, Viva Las Vapes, coming December 14th, dude. So mark that shit on your calendars and get ready to strike kill the game. Because you know your boy, always be killing it.